Hello and welcome to Daily Dose Radio, a five-minute a day podcast studying the Psalms verse by verse, recorded here in the dining room of the Bible Bistro, located in Sharonville, Ohio. Hey there, friend. Welcome back to Daily Dose Radio here in the Bible Bistro. So glad to have you here with me today. And this week, we're going to study Psalm 75, which is only 10 verses long. So we'll have two verses a day as we make our way through Psalm 75. And this psalm has an introduction. So I don't know if we've had, have we had an introduction recently? Well, we had last two weeks. Uh, Two weeks ago, we had an introduction for Psalm 74. It was a miktam, or no, not a miktam. It was a maskal of Asaph. Well, today we have a psalm with an introduction of the choir master. So we have it. He's back on the job. Choir master hadn't gone away, even though Asaph is uh, writing these psalms, because last time, Psalm 74, and now this time, Psalm 75, are both written by Asaph. So, of the choir master, and this word is destroy not, it's al-tishkat, and it's, it means to destroy not, a psalm of Asaph, a song. So we've seen that before. Actually, we've seen two different things here. We've seen the psalm song. Sometimes we've seen it of David. Now we see it of Asaph. So we have both of those. And then this is a do not destroy. Psalm 57 was a psalm that had this designation, do not destroy. And it was when when David was hiding from Saul in the cave of Adullam. So we know about this this kind of psalm, uh, and and here we have it here we have it again. It's uh, either that's a tune name or it's a I don't know if it would be an instrument recounting something perhaps. And so we're going to read this psalm this week. As I said, two verses a day. We're going to read verses one and two today. So if you have your Bible, open it up there with me to Psalm seventy five, and we'll begin with verses one and two. Unto thee, O God, do we give thanks. Unto thee do we give thanks, for that thy name is near thy wondrous works declare. When I shall receive the congregation, I will judge uprightly. So that's verses 1 and 2 here in Psalm 75. So you'll notice that it begins with thanksgiving. We give thanks, and it says, That name is near thy wondrous works declare. And, of course, you know, the, the idea of the, the God's name being connected to his works is always something that we find in the Psalms. And here we have something in verse 2 that sounds very messianic, doesn't it? When I shall receive the congregation, I will judge uprightly. So looking forward to Messiah's reign, perhaps, with that verse. Looking forward, perhaps, to Messiah with that statement. This particular psalm... One of the things that you're going to find as we go through here, and I'll, I'll point it out as we continue, is how much like uh, Hannah's prayer this psalm is. Hannah's prayer really is a it's a nice commentary on these verses. It's I should have said it's not like Hannah's prayer, but it's uh, Hannah's prayer is just a, a wonderful way to read these verses through. And, and Hannah's prayer, if I can just turn there real quick. Hannah's prayer there in 1 Samuel chapter 2, you know, she rejoices in the Lord and is giving thanks to him as well. And she just jumps right into, you know, the the whole thing here by saying, There is none holy as the Lord, for there is none besides thee, neither is there any rock like our God. The wondrous works declare of Psalm 75, really, you know, Hannah kind of puts a highlight on that because what the Lord has done for her in the birth of Samuel, and that's, of course, what she's praying about. It's a prayer of thanksgiving. And this psalm starts out like that as well. I'm going to give thanks. And you'll notice that it's we give thanks. So this is a communal prayer. It's something that we could pray together. We could all pray this prayer in, in, a, in a congregational setting. To the Lord we give thanks. All right, well, join me again tomorrow. We're going to look at verses 3 and 4 here on Daily Dose Radio. 
Thanks for listening to Daily Dose Radio. For more fresh and delicious Bible studies, podcasts, books, and more, check out The Bible Bistro online and on YouTube. Join me again next time for Daily Dose Radio.